Okay, Swifties, so this is how you make your grass heads. I'm gonna do it really quickly. You'll need a stocking. You'll need two cups of uh, dirt soil from here. You'll need two tablespoons of grass seed. You'll need, uh, what else? You'll need an elastic band, a rubber band for its nose. You'll need pipe cleaner and eyes. And remember, I've done some packs, so you guys can come and pick them up if you want, if you don't have all these um, things at home and I'll write a list underneath this post. So first thing you need to do is get your stocking and then cut it. So I've cut the end of it and then from here I'm going to put it on into, I've just got a bowl. The easiest way is to then pop it over the top. So you've got your, so then I've got my sock in there and I'm going to then first pour my grass seed in. So the grass seed's got to go right at the bottom in the toe bit. So from here. And you'll notice that when I cut my stocking, I cut it a long way, okay? So make sure you've got, you've cut it sort of right up near the groin and then we can sort of sort it out after that. And then from here, what I'm gonna do is then put two, my two cups of soil in. You may not need two cups, so you just see how you go. Pack it in from here. got out two cups but we'll see what the size of the head is as I pack it in trying to use the two cups we'll see how it goes so that's two cups from there packed it right down so the grass is at the top and then from here peel off the stocking and then push all the way down into it. So keep going, keep pushing down. Put my hand inside and push that down into there. Yeah, so that's about right. So that was two cups. And then you'll see that the grass is all at the top, which is where you want it, because that's where the hair's gonna grow. And then you can shape your head however you want to from there. Now from here, I'm gonna tie this off. So you can tie it off. Tie it off. And then from here, you can then create, so now I've got a nice little round head. And I can create the nose, which I'm just going to pull a bit of dirt out of. And then I've got my elastic band from here tie my elastic band over and make my little button nose and I can adjust that so now he's got so now we've got our little button nose from here and then you can make you can sort of shape your nose to however you want it to do and then from here so then we've got our little grass head and then you just need some PVC onto some eyes from here. I'm just using blue eyes. Remember, I've got packs of all these guys. So if you need, um, if you just want to kind of grab everything in one shot, it could be handy if I take the PVC lid off. And so if you don't have any eyes or pipe cleaners or things like that, then just yell out and you can do a quick flyby and I'll um, put out what you need. So then I'm going to stick my eye on. And I've used blue eyes and I've got lots of different coloured eyes. So you can kind of create your person however you want to. And then from here, put the other eye on. So we're starting... How cute is that? And then we're using pipe cleaners for mouths. So from here, you just need a pipe cleaner. And the reason we're using pipe cleaners will prefer it than rather than fabric is you, you can kind of shape your mouth however you then want it to look. And then what we're doing with the pipe cleaner is that you're gonna stick it in, because the metal bits, so just kind of jab it in until it breaks stocking. 
and then you can kind of form it around and then make the other mouth. I might actually make this mouth a little bit smaller. And then two, chop off his other mouth. Make him a bit smaller. And then stick it in the other side. So I'll play around with his mouth to get the mouth right. It needs to be a little bit smaller, but I'll cut him and we'll work it from there. So then I'm starting to get that. And then from here, his mouth does need to be a bit smaller. I'm just going to cut it off a little bit more. And stick the other end of it back in again. Oh, too good. Too good. And then from here, we're going to, I've just got some things to decorate him. So my little, I've got, I'm gonna have a little flower that sticks on. And if it doesn't, then I'll grab some PB glue and stick that onto the glass as well. Which is not going to. Maybe stick it on the side of his head. There you go. Ah! <laughs> All right, so the idea of this is make sure, and then you're gonna fill it with water. So you're gonna fill the glass jar with water as this little flower falls off. So fill up that with water. The end of it goes in. I can cut a bit more of the stocking off. I don't need that much stocking now. And then he will grow over the next six weeks. Poke him down and then what will happen is the stocking will slowly fill up with water and that will come up and fill up there. And then I can put his little fascinator back on, her fascinator back on. All right, so then that, and then the sheets that go with it will describe exactly what you need to do with it. And remember, it's a fun thing, have fun with it, you know chat to it to whatever it's just something to kind of you know it's one of those icebreakers when we're all going back into iso for another six weeks um you know crazy times call for crazy measures so have a bit of fun with it as it starts to grow the grass will grow up here and you can trim it but the biggest thing is obviously and why we're doing it is this wellness chart so then to look at making sure that we're getting water when we're checking its water getting outside for some outdoor movement every day or being outside, getting our movement in every day, getting our swift sessions in, eating real food, getting some rest, getting to bed early and just seeing whether we can really ground ourselves with this project. So even if the grass head isn't your thing, it's going to be my thing and you're going to see photos of my grass head growing as he grows, then as you as you are going through it, then, you know, it's just super important to then make sure that this is the checklist that you're going generally following just to get the grassroots stuff really down pat in relation to wellness so you can keep yourself really grounded over the next six weeks. There is seven weeks. Obviously, I just threw in seven weeks because I had an extra bit of space in the sheet. So, you know, if it flows over to seven weeks and we've got seven weeks to work with. Have fun with it, guys. Ask me any questions. I want to see lots of pictures of your little grass heads. Yes, she says. And um, yeah, and let's see how this goes. Let's be a bit wacky and a bit funny and go from there. All right, guys. See ya. Bye.